Mighty. Welcome back with Cookie with Nana. Today I have a lot of requests. Um, people ask me how to do padak. The padak I'm doing to show you is how we will do for papaya salad. So I have this, how my mom has taught me. She's been telling me how to do the padak for papaya. And I would love to thank you, my mom, and she's rest in peace for all her um, recipe that she have left behind for me to show you guys. So my main ingredients that I have for my padak is, I use this brand of padak. We have a homemade padak already in a bucket, but instead, if you don't have the homemade padak, you can use this brand. So three bottles of padak. And I have fish sauce. The fish sauce, this one is like the, it's the six ounce. So kind of you can do like um, two bottles of fish sauce. So this, so I have two um, of the shrimp paste. You can use any brand you like that you prefer to use, but I am using this um, twin chicken brand. And then the crab paste. This is the crab paste. This one will make your um, sauce a little bit darker. It depends you want, you know, it's up to you if you want to use one or two, but I'm using two. And MSG. Like I said, I have one cup of MSG. You can use MSG as you want. If you don't want to use MSG, you don't have to. It's an option. And tamarind seedless pack. I have one pack of this. And I have this blue crab. It's frozen right here and then frozen olive in Lao we call this makok you know like well every time our parents always say you want makok you know so we know that's what it means so this is the um, fresh olive the Asian kind so the first thing I will do is mix my tamarind I have to soak it in hot water okay Hot water. Okay. Probably use that like a a cup until that. Mix, break it because we want the juice of the tamarind. Okay. I'm just going to use the crab, the blue crab meat. See how big it is? If it's too big, you can cut it in half. Because there's no small side. So. And if you prefer to use dry shrimp with it, you can, but um, you don't have to. It's up to you. But I'm not going to use dry shrimp. Okay. Set this on side. Okay. Now you will go. Just rinse it in cold water. Once you rinse it in cold water, use a knife, just cut a little bit, just on, just to get the flavor from it, like that. Okay, and now I'm going to mix everything. Shrimp paste. Um, the shrimp paste, when it's not, when it's fresh, they have the wax on top of it. You have to take it out because we don't use the wax. The wax. Okay. So I'm going to mix all this in one pie first. Okay. 
Okay, and I'm gonna use the crab paste. I'm gonna mix in here. So I am gonna use MSG, one cup. Like I say, if you wanna use MSG, you can. And then the, the tamarind. I'm using the whole seeds, everything in here. So I'm gonna mix it. So I'm gonna add um, one cup of hot water in here. Okay. And then my fish sauce. So I am going to add the snack. So this is the stuff that I mixed already. The shrimp paste, the crab paste, the MSG, and the fish sauce all in one pie right here. Okay, and then now in this pot, I'm going to add the three bottles of the padak in here. Try to get all this flavor. In, out from it. Let's shake the bottles. You see how they have like those there in the bottom of it there's, there's flavor in there so we're going to add a little bit hot water from here not too much okay from one bottle to the next bottle Just a little bit. So they already um, cooked the padak already in that bottle. So we don't have to cook too much. So I'm going to pour all this in here. Ooh, careful. careful with you pouring down because you don't want that to splash everywhere in your house. Okay, then I'm going to add the crab meat, the blue crab in here, and the makgeok, the olive, in here. Mix it. Once you add everything, you're going to Put this in the stove and, and boil it from to 30 minutes to an hour. But I'm, I'm going to do 30 minutes because, like I said, the one in the bottle is already boiled for you already. It's already cooked and stuff. And then um, the one that, say you have a raw one that's um, in your bucket or whatever that your parents have done already, you have to boil that longer. But then I'm not adding, uh, people add a lot of water, but I'm not going to add mine. No water. I just add a little bit that mixing to get all that flavor out from the bottles and all that stuff and then um, make sure if you're gonna do this inside your kitchen you have to open all your window and all your fan or whatever because it will smell it will kill your house so if you can cook outside and do it do it outside because, like I warn you, it will smell, but it will it does taste good after it's done. So we're gonna go ahead and show you that we how we boil this down 
to make a papaya sauce. I have to come do outside because if I do outside, my house will be like smell love of padak. But like I said, it's better if you have stove outside, do outside. If you know, it's that way. Oh, I've got to cut half of this other crap. Um, so let it boil after it boils, then you steam, um, simmer it down for and then keep you know, stir once in a while. You don't have to stir all the time. See how it's getting starting a little bit boiling up a little bit. See, and then we start stirring it. Okay, see how it boils. Well, now we're gonna have to lower it down to. To low to um, just to simmer it. So I let it um, simmer for another thirty minutes. Keep stirring it. Once when it's steam um, sim simmered for thirty minutes, turn it off and let it cool. And then when it, once it's cooled down, we're gonna um, put in a jar. So um, this is nam padak for tamahong. Mans out ma pin See, and this is how it's gonna turn out. So when once it cool down, you can jaw, put it in a jar, um, to make for your papaya. And this will last you a long time. Okay, so this is what I'm gonna do next. Okay. I have my clean jar. Okay. And you see, I have the um, the crab, the olive. I'm gonna put in here first. Seal it up real tight and then rinse it up. Right there. This is my homemade padak for papaya salad. So let's see all my pen see and that's how it will turn out to be. You can use the papaya, um, papaya for papaya salad for any kind of thumb that you prefer. This is the padak sauce for for any thumb that you want to add on. This so, is how I do it, and this is how my mom have give me her um, recipe. So she have been there teach all her kids the things that she learns and here I am giving you guys the new generations the person that you know giving to you guys the thing that I learned from my mom and and bless her heart that she have um, teach me so I hope you guys try it out um, and tell me how it is and like I say, Kop Jalalai, Mabung Video Koi, and thank you so much for watching my YouTube. And thank you, thank you, thank you, out of my heart. And Tanaho Jerk and my Lakon.